Since Superstorm Sandy hit, volunteers have gotten to work cleaning up and helping those devastated on Long Island. But these aren't just any volunteers. They're members of the Hofstra University equestrian team. The team has decided to take a break from the barn and give back to the community. I was looking into volunteering uh, just around, and I just didn't know where to start, so I was glad that the president of, of Hewitt ended up being like, let's volunteer, so it was just like perfect timing. The team headed out to Long Beach to clean up a woman's home that had been flooded with almost five feet of water. I mean, the water line was up to my eyes, and I'm six foot tall, so I was, it was a real big like, shock factor for me, but I liked I liked working with like, you know, my teammates on the equestrian team and doing something that was like helping someone else. The house, it was completely destroyed. There was stuff everywhere. We had to climb over the fridge in order to just open the garage door. <laughs> my house was renovated a long time ago. I got to see how it was put up, but then you don't see how it, I didn't see how it was demolished in the first place. So it was kind of interesting and sad at the same time and frustrating and you got to get your anger out. Working among the devastation also proved to be an unexpected emotional experience for the girls. The garbage truck came and was picking up, like with this huge crane, was picking up all the garbage, just like all the way down the street and I just couldn't believe that like this was once a beautiful town and that it's just like this is all coming out of people's basements and it's just like their whole family pictures and everything and they have to rebuild all those memories and it's really sad. I, I would try to do more demo work or stuff like that and help again, yes. As the team continues their efforts, one thing remains certain. There is still plenty of work to be done. Laurel Kaufman, Long Island Report.